Hello everyone, welcome to Web Technology. Uh, in this tutorial, I'll show you everything about CSS. CSS is actually very easy. I will show you how you can turn a basic HTML page from this to something like this. So let's get started. Uh, that's our header part. Then this will be our navigation. Then a picture. Then I will add some text. Then a text and a picture side by side. Then the footer part over there. So I'll show you how we can make it. So let's get started. So I already created a folder named HTML CSS. I already have two picture inside this folder. So I have some code writing over here. I'll just save it inside that folder. Uh, it's in the H, then YouTube, then HTML CSS. I'll name it index.html. Let's save it. I will have another file. I will name it style.css and save it inside uh, that folder and this is why basically we write our css so let's uh, make the basic structure of our html page uh, so our header will be uh, web tech knowledge and then let's add a div and inside the, this div i will add our Navigation part, uh, UL, opening UL, closing, then list, LI, and the first one will be home. Uh, sorry for the spelling mistake. And I'll add anchor tag over here as well. And let's say href is equal to hash. It means if we click it, it will take us to the same place. Let's copy it and paste it three times. Home, uh, then we'll about contract. Then the last one will be new. Okay, uh, let's open it. Okay, that's how it looks. Now let's add image. So image our uh, source is equal to photo one dot png. Let's give give it some height and width. Two hundred and width will be four hundred. Now let's add some text. Uh, let's say this is a text for a video tutorial let's copy it and paste it multiple time okay let's save it okay let's save it and okay now let's uh, put another text uh, and another image now this text and this image will stay side by side well, let's add the height and width as well let's copy it and paste over here let's refresh it okay now only the footer part is left let's keep it inside div let's say uh, h3 equal to enter it off copyright reserved by what technology let's save it and refresh it okay that's our basic html structure now i will apply css to turn it into something new so let's if you want to change the body color i just have to write body then background inside uh, body i have to write background color gray and it will change the body color uh, oh sorry i have to give the link of the style.css in the head inside the head so i have to write link rail is equal to a uh, style sheet then text ty type is equal to text slash css and uh, href is equal to style.css and it's a self-closing tag let's save it and let's refresh okay i did some mistake spelling mistake okay okay our background color changed over here okay now i will edit the header part so web technology so let's add id is equal to header now if i since i write id i have to write hash header for id i have to write hash at the beginning so background color will be the header background color will be blue and that text will be in the middle so for that i have to write text align center and then text color will be white so color white let's refresh it okay that's how it looks now i will uh, edit the nav option 
okay let's add id is equal to nav okay i already use nav so id so this time i will use class class is equal to nav so for class i have to write dot at the beginning so dot nav so i want to edit the ul part so dot nav ul then to curly bracket and inside it i'll write list style type okay equal none and uh, margin will be zero and padding will be 10 and overflow will be hidden and the last one background color will be black okay let's save it and refresh it okay that's how it looks now i want to edit the list part so for that i have to write nav li and li is this part li then to curly bracket then float i want to have it on the left side so left you can say right or mid uh, center as well okay let's add dot nav li a it means i want to edit right now the anchor text so i'll say display block it means uh, the text will be uh, show in a block size and the text color will be white color white and text will be uh, in the center of that block so for this i have to write text align center and padding let's say 14 px and 16 px um, it means it's the uh, height and width of the block and text decoration will be none let's refresh okay that's how it looks right now but if i hover the mouse nothing happened so i want to change the color uh, when i hover the mouse so i have to write nav li a hover then to curly bracket and say background color gray so right now uh, if i hover the mouse the color will change into gray okay now let's uh edit the image part let's just cut it from here let's say class is equal to uh, main image let's say dot main image img let's width uh, let's, height will be 200 and px and width will be 1200 px let's save it and refresh it that's how it looks now i want to edit the next text so let's add a div option over here div opening div closing for this particular text say class is equal to main main text main para let's say main para then dot main para to curly bracket then width 1200 px i think uh, this is enough refresh it okay this is how it looks now let's uh, edit this uh, edit the other text and the image I, I want the other text and the image uh, side by side so i will put the text and the image inside a div and i will name it uh, name class is equal to content okay now let's say dot content since it's a class so dot uh, let's say p first it means uh, the text uh, let's say with 800 px the background color will be black and the and it will float on the left side uh, so i want the image float on the right side so for this i'll write dot content img uh, float right so it will make our image float on the right side let's save it refresh it okay nothing changed something is wrong let's see okay everything is okay over here i think it's on the index okay i put two of those over there so 
press save it again and refresh it okay that's how it looks so now uh, you can see the header part in the middle so I will just add sorry a footer part in the middle so I'll just add footer footer I just have to say clear board so the footer will be at the end so let's just decorate it like a little bit text align will be center and background color will be white let's refresh okay that's how it looks now I will just change the looks a little bit for it uh, I'll just uh, add a diff another diff uh, for everything inside the body because I want to put uh, everything on my web page just in the middle let's name it container now I will go to style.css and write hash container to curly bracket I will say first background color I will set as gray and width will be 1200 px let's just to refresh it okay if I want to uh, keep everything in the middle I just have to write margin left auto and margin right auto let's save it and refresh it okay everything is now in the middle I hope uh, you learn a lot from this video and please uh, press the subscribe button I will actually really appreciate it and thank you very much again for watching this video.